anti-baby thing. And then um, she started to applaud herself Aww. and just stood for half an hour like clapping her own bum. And um, I, I thought she's probably more clever than me and she was only one. So I wrote this poem while I was watching my daughter applaud her naked bum. And it's called, Wow. <clears throat> my body is amazing. I can almost hear her saying it. As she stands naked at that mirror, hands clapping in applause to it. She's naked, bold and proud. Her mouth open wide and round like, wow, my body is amazing. She's one year old and loving it, big belly sticking out. Thighs like mini tire towers and when she looks at her reflection, she always shouts aloud like, wow, this body is so great. Gazing down now, I try to do the same. Ignore the plastic advert spreads that pass me on the way. I say my body is amazing, despite what some might say. I say my body is amazing, despite the claims you make. The nip and tuck and cuts and sucks that fill my walk to work each day. Enhancement ads and happiness will only come with curves this way. And if I lay in front of you today, clothes drop to the floor. You'd prescribe me what I could have less of and what I should want more of. A tick box, what could be chopped off your red pen ready hand aside, your eyes deciding what to slice from lips to cheek to bum to thighs. The lines below my eyes, you say, I ought to peel or pull away. My breasts will start to sag one day, that breastfed baby there to blame. She came into the world, you say that's great, but now behold your face, your saggy stomach, baggy eyes, stretch mark skin, you look and sigh. My eyes tighten, my legs inject, my thighs cut back, my head perfect, my stomach flat and my breasts enhanced, don't smile too much, oh God, don't laugh. As you mark me, like a canvas page in circled bouts of red, I feel the need to tell you, you might praise our skin instead. Cause as you chat about correction, you're plucking cuts and lasers, briefcase stuff with time relapses, scalpel, lead erasers, I'll take up your red pen to my cheeks and mark two stripes on either side. A naked, painted warrior could be a sore sight for eyes, cause I am ready for your battles now. My body's felt the worst. No scalpel cut intense as that last damn push of birth. And I have seen with awed amazement what a body brave can do. And now I mark like tribal tattoos with the tails my flesh went through. But those stripes that line my saggy stomach mark me like gold. And the folds below my eyes tell a tale just as bold. My laughter lines are getting deeper now because I smile twice as much. So if you palm read these first wrinkles, my life would light up. The official position is that smooth skin is queen, but without any lines, there's no reading between them. A storybook is opening, my life has just begun, and once a pond never plays, if I cling to line one as you try to cover the living I've done, as a human, a woman, and now as a mum. But your red pen can't rub out the nights I've not slept, the parts that I've bled or the laughter I've wept, the baby I held in a stomach that stretched, the breast that got heavy so baby was fed, the parties I've had out, the sleep I've missed out on, the dinners I've shoved down my throat like a python. As you pile on the pressure to cover my life, I wonder what on earth is so wrong with your sight. If my mind and my memory can tell you my tales, then why can my body not tell them as well? As our babies stand naked, applauding their skin, I can't wait for their lives and their lines to begin. Thank you.